Hey there, this is Darren Miles with Darren Miles Photography based here in beautiful, sunny Naples, Florida. If you've watched my channel for a while, you might have noticed that I'll often mention that a lens suffers from chromatic aberration. But then I'll be quick to mention that fortunately, chromatic aberration is one of those things that can be very quickly fixed with just a couple of clicks in programs like Lightroom 6. What I didn't realize is how many folks apparently didn't know exactly how to fix chromatic aberrations. So what I thought I'd do is show you how to fix it with just a couple of clicks in Lightroom. Now, before we do that, what exactly is chromatic aberration? Well, without getting into a big, long technical explanation, chromatic aberration happens in the transition areas of an image between really bright and really dark areas. Sometimes it's expressed as a red or a green, but most often, at least in my experience anyway, it appears as purple fringing in the contrast areas. Now, some lenses handle this transition really well, Others, well, not so much. Now the image here that we're looking at was taken with a Sony A7 Mark II with the brand new Sony Zeiss 35mm f1.4 lens. It was shot at f1.4. And if you look over here to the left, you can see that there is a ton of purple fringing. The sunlight hit these puddles of water and the transition is a really ugly purple fringy kind of thing. But actually in this image, I kind of think the purple fringing sort of adds to the overall grunginess of the scene. But anyway, what we want to do is remove that purple stuff with Lightroom. So here's how we do it. First, what you want to do is click on the develop module on top and then scroll down on the right to the lens correction panel. And here you have some options, basic, profile, color, and manual. What we want to do is click on color. And you'll note that there's a checkbox um, here if it isn't checked, make sure you check it. It should say remove chromatic aberration or that should be checked. And let's see, if you'll notice, what you want to do next is click on this eyedropper and bring it over to the aberration area. What you'll see is a pixel level detailed view. And what you want to do is make sure the dropper is right over a purple pixel, preferably a really dark one. You'll see a little plus sign there. And then you want to click on it and voila. Just like that, no chromatic aberrations. Now, in truth, it's not always this simple, but it's like this often enough. So when you hear that a lens has chromatic aberration problems, well, fear not, because clearly Lightroom can save the day. So just to review, here's before, and here's after. So, there you go. That's how you fix chromatic aberrations in Lightroom. This is Darren Miles with Darren Miles Photography, based here in beautiful, sunny Naples, Florida. If you like these reviews and tips, please don't forget to subscribe. Thank you so much for watching, and until the next time, happy shooting.